Throughout history, few celestial events have captivated humanity as profoundly as eclipses. These cosmic phenomena, where the sun or moon seemingly vanishes from the sky, have inspired awe, fear and wonder in equal measure. Eclipses are powerful reminders of the celestial clockwork governing our universe. For millennia, civilizations across the globe have woven these events into their myths, religions and scientific endeavors. Eclipses are more than just astronomical occurrences. They are celestial markers etched into the fabric of human history. From the earliest astronomers in ancient China to modern-day astrophysicists, understanding and predicting eclipses has been a driving force in scientific exploration. These celestial ballets have spurred advancements in astronomy, mathematics and physics. More than just scientific curiosities, eclipses have played pivotal roles in shaping the course of human events, influencing the outcomes of battles, toppling dynasties and even validating groundbreaking scientific theories. In ancient China, eclipses were believed to be omens, often interpreted as signs of celestial displeasure with the ruling dynasty. The story of the eclipse of 2134 BC exemplifies this belief and its dramatic consequences. According to Chinese mythology, the emperor had failed to heed the astronomers' predictions of the eclipse. As the sun vanished from the sky, plunging the world into darkness, panic ensued. People believed the celestial dragon was devouring the sun, a sign of impending doom. The emperor, caught unprepared, was seen as having lost the mandate of heaven. This event, recorded in ancient Chinese texts, highlights the profound impact eclipses had on Chinese society and the perceived link between celestial events and earthly affairs. The eclipse of 2134 BC serves as a potent reminder of the power of these celestial events to shape not only our understanding of the cosmos, but also the course of human history. The Battle of Halis, fought in 585 BC between the Lydians and the Medes, is a testament to the power of eclipses to alter the course of history. As the two armies clashed on the battlefield, an unexpected event unfolded in the heavens, a total solar eclipse. The sky darkened, plunging the battlefield into an eerie twilight. This sudden and unexpected darkness recorded by the Greek historian Herodotus had a profound impact on the warring faction. The eclipse, predicted by the Greek philosopher Thales of Miletus, was interpreted by both sides as a sign to end the conflict. Fear and awe replaced the clash of swords as the eclipse unfolded. The warring factions, startled by the celestial display, agreed to an immediate ceasefire. This event, forever etched in history as the Battle of the Eclipse, marked the end of a 15-year war. It stands as a powerful testament to the ability of eclipses to inspire peace and alter the course of human conflict. The Peloponnesian War, a decades-long struggle between Athens and Sparta, witnessed a turning point influenced by a lunar eclipse. In 413 BC, the Athenian army, deeply entrenched in a campaign against Syracuse, was on the verge of victory. However, as they prepared for a strategic retreat by sea, a lunar eclipse darkened the night sky. This celestial event, steeped in superstition, sowed panic and confusion among the Athenian ranks. The eclipse was interpreted as a bad omen, sapping the morale of the Athenian soldiers and sailors. The Syracusans, emboldened by the perceived celestial favor, pressed their attack. The resulting delay, caused by the eclipse and the ensuing panic, proved disastrous for the Athenians. Their fleet was decimated, marking a turning point in the war that ultimately led to their defeat. The lunar eclipse of 413 BC stands as a stark reminder of the power of celestial events to influence even the most carefully laid plans and shape the destinies of nations. Section 5. Columbus and the Eclipse Stranded in Jamaica. In 1504, during his fourth and final voyage to the New World, Christopher Columbus found himself stranded in Jamaica. His ships, ravaged by worms and storms, were no longer seaworthy. The indigenous Arawak people, initially welcoming, grew weary of providing for Columbus and his crew. Facing starvation and desperate to regain the Arawak's favor, Columbus devised a plan using his knowledge of an upcoming lunar eclipse. 
On the night of the eclipse, Columbus gathered the Arawak leaders and with theatrical flair announced that his god was angry with their lack of hospitality. As proof, he proclaimed, the moon would vanish from the sky. As predicted, the lunar eclipse commenced, casting an eerie red shadow over the moon. The Arawaks, terrified by this celestial display, pleaded with Columbus to intercede with his god. Columbus, feigning reluctance, eventually agreed and, after a calculated period, the moon reappeared. This cunning use of celestial knowledge not only saved Columbus and his crew, but also cemented the eclipse's place in the annals of exploration. Section 6. Predicting the Eclipse. George Davidson's Alaskan Triumph. The total solar eclipse of August 7, 1869, provided a pivotal moment for both astronomy and the mapping of the United States. George Davidson, a renowned geodesist with the U.S. Coast Survey, led an expedition to Alaska to observe the eclipse with unprecedented accuracy. Davidson's primary goal was to precisely time the eclipse's duration, a measurement critical for refining the geographic coordinates of the American West. At that time, the American West remained largely unmapped, hindering transportation and communication. Davidson's precise measurements of the eclipse, made possible by the remoteness of his observation point in Alaska, provided invaluable data for improving maps and charts of the region. His work had a lasting impact, facilitating westward expansion and connecting the nation. The 1869 eclipse highlights the intersection of scientific exploration and national development, demonstrating how celestial events could be harnessed to advance human understanding and shape the future of a nation. Section 7, Einstein's Eclipse Proving Relativity. In 1919, a solar eclipse tested Einstein's theory of general relativity. Einstein proposed gravity as a curvature in space-time. Light bends near massive objects like the sun. The eclipse confirmed Einstein's predictions. Sir Arthur Eddington's expedition changed our understanding of gravity. Section 8, Conclusion. Eclipses and the Course of History. From the earliest civilizations to the present day, eclipses have captivated humanity, inspiring awe, fear, and scientific curiosity. These celestial events, once seen as omens or divine interventions, have played pivotal roles in shaping the course of human history. From toppling dynasties to ending wars, validating scientific theories to inspiring exploration, eclipses have left an indelible mark on our collective consciousness. As we continue to unravel the mysteries of the universe, these celestial ballets serve as potent reminders of our place in the cosmos and the interconnectedness of all things. Eclipses are not merely astronomical events, they are celestial markers etched into the fabric of human history, shaping our understanding of the universe and our place within it.